Bronson. Yes, madam. You had every right to feel violated. But you didn't react with anger. How are you doing? Well, it hasn't been easy. I miss her terribly. I know. I still can't believe they found her that way. Stuffed. Dead. Inside unclaimed padlocked luggage. Yes. Cold to the touch. Who could have done such an awful thing to her? I don't know, Shade. I don't think she had enemies that wanted to kill her. Bronson, do we ever know what someone's dealing with throughout life? You have a point. Indeed. She was an amazing wife. An even better human being and business partner. I'm thankful we spent 15 pleasantly challenging, yet happy years together. You are the ideal couple. I was glad she chose you. Thank you. Looking back now, I should have listened to my husband and mother. All those years ago, to have more children. She was my only child. Any hope for grandchildren's gone. Detective Rockville. He's overseeing the investigation. I see. I've heard in previous cases, Peter has a tendency to get distracted. It's common knowledge, I suppose, my dear. Might explain his current state of skittish affairs, albeit... I'm quite certain he's performed in this capacity, taking into account he's been on the force since the 70s. Yes, well. His father was a jolly old soul once upon a time. Though after. Lost at sea. Nearly three decades ago. They never recovered the body. I reckoned hearing such story. One must say, lots of unanswered questions. How do you know? I don't. Quite interesting, wouldn't you say? He's a distant memory now, I'm sure. Shade. I have to ask the same question. Are you familiar with his case? No. But, that is the point I've arrived to. Anyway, it won't do us any good to worry prematurely about my daughter's case. I'm afraid it won't. She'd want us to keep our faculties. Even if it seems we're losing ground, knowing a heinous killer's on the loose. Not until we get further information. So... I overheard you speaking to Alora. Will she be joining us for dinner? Hunter. I'm working. You're in between flights. We need to talk. Find another hobby. I don't have time. Sola, my patience is short. Make time. We're all being investigated for Bronson's wife's death. I don't have anything to do with that. I'm not the one you have to convince. Where are you? I'm closer to you than you think. I bet looking back, you wish you had have taken the money. Hindsight is 2020, But I'm perfectly fine. Being a pilot. 
It's my dream since a little girl. Not another plot. Or scheme. To get rich quick. Keep telling yourself, what you settled on was better than my offer. It's gotten me this far. All of these years. Without regret. Or feeling unfortunate and empty inside. And this dream. Will be all up in smoke. When they lock you away for the rest of your life. You're not in the clear. Hunter. Lord. Would that be a fair assumption to make? Why? Do you think I'm here? For my health solar? No. I suggest you think of what your alibi is going to be. Instead of making me see a future that may be tailored just for you. Look. It doesn't take a highly sophisticated scholar to see Bronson has pointed them straight in our direction. Hunter, I have my job to protect. Sola, we have our lives to protect. And to add insult to injury, I'm still waiting on a very big shipment he has yet to fulfill. Diamonds. Half a million's worth. Bronson's wife was killed in the worst way possible. I'm a lot of things, but I'm not a killer. Hunter, calm down. Passengers are soon to arrive. Get a grip. I can't go to prison. I didn't do this. And I did? No. I am not guilty either. What? Just what am I supposed to tell authorities? That's what we're here to figure out. That I knew her before. Sweet as pie. Till I knocked over and broke. I've asked her deceased great aunt had given her. More terrible things happened between us. It wasn't a walk in the park strolling for candy. Being a good friend, a shoulder for his wife to lean on. You're describing motive and opportunity. Very easy to pin a crime. I guess that's how they see it. If it's their mission. And they run out of time. Unfortunately. When you operate within a financial bracket transactions totaling millions, they turn up the microscope lens. What's your deepest observation on this hunter? What connects you to this murder? Business dealings Bronson and I are a part of. Large monetary exchange of hands. There must be more. There isn't. They need someone to blame. Or, they think there were hiccups along the way. And you wanted retaliation. It's crazy. I know. Very. But we're not monsters for Christ's sake. I mean, at least I'm not. Sola, what are you saying? I just told you I'm innocent like you. Look. The woman was found crammed inside a luggage bag with a frightened facial expression locked in place. The media didn't mention that. How do you know? It's the only logical conclusion in a scenario like this. How can that not be the case? Think about it. Anyway. After her father died, I experienced a dark side when we got closer as friends. I'm sure a Bronson witnessed her change in personality. He and I had done business many years. Frankly, there were details she'd been better off not knowing. She did something dreadful to me. I don't care to relive or disclose. Out of sheer embarrassment. Good friends should never do to each other what she did. It's a cold world. And it's about to get colder. It's... it's nothing like that at all. I was just... collecting the rest of my belongings. 
I caught you searching through my wife's personal things. Now you're washing clothes. Yes, well, I'm sure it appeared that way, but... What do you have to say for yourself, Diane? Bronson. You don't understand. I understand perfectly. Deborah trusted you. She's good to you. She even let you borrow her luggage for your trip to Paris. Subsequently, failing to return a few pieces. This is how you repay her. How you show gratitude. For our tremendous generosity through employment for the last five years. I was pure legendary. True skills on every level. Earning every penny. I deserved more. Care to elaborate? Oh, let's see. How about I was like... Renaissance. Art. Can't put numerical value on priceless work. But... Worth endless praise. An awful truth. Precisely. I see. It boiled down to the matter at hand. Using a key we gave you unlawfully is beneath you, Diane. Well, I didn't deserve to be treated the way Deborah handled me. And I didn't use your key. I left it on the shelf in the guest house as Deborah instructed. Who let you in this house? I let myself in. My way. You're out of line. I can just as easily have you arrested for trespassing. The people in this town warned me about the Sabah family. Nonsense. The rich always think they can buy and sell everyone else. I should have listened. Now I'm staying in a grungy motel watching Montel Williams reruns with no running water disgusting food and flea bag mattresses. Look, Diane. That was your decision. Not ours. You've never saw things my way. Fake. That's what you people portray. I'm sorry you were so unhappy. You're not sorry. You and the little missus never take responsibility for poor treatment of employees. How can your perception be wildly distorted? It's not. Couldn't be. Further from the truth. No talking. No whispering. Quite time isn't over. You're absolutely correct. So... It brings us back to what we've discussed previously. What is narcissistic personality disorder? A disorder in which a person has an inflated sense of self-importance. It's found more commonly in men. The cause is unknown, but likely involves a combination of genetic and environmental factors. Take out your textbooks please. Because everyone knows, you and Bronson's wife didn't like each other very much. The day they think she was killed. Was the day you and I were at the 7th annual Rare Stones convention.
What are you getting at, Hunter? Do you remember? Yes. Good. 